Hi guys, I received quite a lot of requests for tutorial on how to set up Zen Server on Vagrant. So I caved under the pressure and here it is. What you'll be seeing is how to install Zen Server on a fully functional Linux PHP environment using Vagrant and Oracle's VirtualBox and on a Windows host machine. Before you start, you'll need to download and install VirtualBox and Vagrant. Your first step is to create a new folder for all your virtual machines. In this folder, create an additional folder for this particular VM. Then, cd into the folder and enter the Vagrant initialization command. Next, we have to add a new box instance. Instead of downloading the Vagrant box file each time you create a VM, I've already downloaded the box file onto my hard drive. Of course you can download any Linux you want, but I chose the standard Ubuntu 1204 32-bit box. I'm going to copy it into my main VMs folder, and then issue the following command for adding the box to my VM. OK, our next step is to open the Vagrant file created in our VM folder and edit it as follows. First, I'm going to change the value for config VM box from base to the name of our VM, zsdev. Then, to assign a private network IP for our VM, I'm going to uncomment the following line. Once we're done editing the Vagrant file, we can now boot our new VM. Note the port forwarding here, because we'll need this port when we SSH into the machine. OK, our Linux VM is up and running. Now let's install Zen Server. First, we're going to SSH into our VM. So let's open PuTTY. I'm going to connect to our VM using localhost and the forwarded port we saw before, 2203. The username and password for accessing the VM is Vagrant and we're in. So first we're going to download the Zen Server repository installer. Now let's extract the targz file. We're going to cd into it. And finally, run the installer. You can install Zen Server with either PHP 5.5 or 5.6. I'm going to go for 5.5. We get this notification at the beginning, and all we have to do is press enter. Zen Server starts to install all the packages involved in the Zen Server installation. Hit enter yes to continue.
That's it. Zen server is installed on our VM. What we're now going to do is launch Zen server. To do this, open your browser and enter the private network IP we defined earlier in the Vagrant file, together with the port the Zen server UI uses. Okay, what you're now looking at is the Zen server launching wizard, which is a very easy and quick process. First, you're going to read and accept the end user license agreement. And on the next dialog, you can select which settings you want to launch Zen Server with. Selecting development, for example, launches Zen Server with server and PHP settings optimized for development environment, including an enabled zero. So I'm going to go for that option. And in the next dialog, you need to enter a password for accessing the Zen Server UI. Clicking next, Zen Server installs the built in PHP libraries. And all we have to do now is click the launch button. And there you have it. I hope that covers it all. Please let me know if you've got any feedback or any questions. Thanks for watching.